I'm gonna ask a really difficult question, but I think it's one that we all, as pastors and leaders, must wrestle with. Pastor Robert has asked this in his books. Ask yourself this question. Are you concerned with the Jewish people? And I'm not asking you to answer that now in a right or wrong way. I just want you to ask yourself that question and sit on the answer. And be very honest, there's no condemnation. But if the answer to that question is no, you're not very concerned about it, then I would say to you that you are getting in the way of God blessing you, your ministry, and your community through you. The reason I say that is because the Jewish people are covenantally betrothed to God for eternity. This is what God says in Deuteronomy chapter 7. He says that I have taken you as a firstborn. You're my prized possession to the Jewish people. And if we as leaders will not concern ourselves with the things that God calls his prized possession, it's just hard for me to believe that God can fully bless what we're doing. I'm not saying he's not going to bless you. I'm saying that you could be getting in the way of really unlocking a rich blessing for your church. And if we concern ourselves with this as pastors and leaders, I believe we will step into a greater level of blessing that God wants to pour out on us and on our churches.